We're now going to look at two different um, unique situations that um, are, are sort of not the normal. Sort of, uh, these are looking at uncommon scores. The very first one we'll look at is when top leaders score below the managers in the workforce. The common view that you've been seeing pretty consistently is that top leaders have a more positive view of the organization than the workforce. Uh, the managers tend to be um, um, a little higher than the workforce, but not nearly as high as the top managers, which um, you know is, is pretty normal, and we talked about explanations for that as to why top leaders tend to see the organization more positively, which creates a low perception match, and that conversation that can take place in following up with the OLA. Well, on occasion, you'll find a situation like the one you're seeing here on the screen. Uh, you can see that the top leader, the red bar, is, uh, I think, in every instance, except possibly shared leadership at the bottom, lower than the, the managers and lower than the workforce. And um, this is a, uh, a nonprofit ministry organization in Guyana, South, South America. And um, I had the opportunity to talk to the top leader about this situation, and uh, I suggested to her that what this what this could uh, reflect is that the top leaders see themselves as um, overworked, and in a sense, a lot of the organizational burden falls upon the top leaders. Uh, the top leaders are. Um, um, you know, leading a strong organization. In fact, in this particular organization, uh, we see that they're a level five. And here you can see the workforce. By the way, this is the older report. That's why you're seeing a different color uh, bar um, than the new report. And in this situation, let's see how many. We had four top leaders, we had three managers, and we had ten workforce. So the workforce scored this positively at a level five. But the top leaders, um, though they got into a level five under value people and just about just over the line on share leadership, they scored below that. And display authenticity was, was uh, down at the lower end of the org four. But when I raised this possibility uh, with the executive director, the possibility that the top leadership felt uh, overworked, overburdened, and, um, and she said that that rang true, that uh, there was a lot of pressure on the top leaders to raise funds, uh, to deal with uh, uh, some lack of performance, some accountability issues with the managers and with the workforce. And you can see uh, between the green bar and the blue bar, the managers and the workforce is a very positive uh, relationship, uh, a close perception match, uh, they see every category as being in a level five or even for managers up into a level six. But again, the top workers, and, and, and in this situation, I think we would spend some time uh, coaching and uh, having a uh, good conversation with the top leaders to talk about how they can um, perhaps delegate uh, more work, how they can empower people. Um, uh, that may not be ready for it. They may not uh, want to take on more work, but obviously it's important that the top leaders uh, 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 see themselves more positively and see the organization more positively. Okay, now I'm going to switch over to a different issue, and uh, this is looking at what happens when the managers, the manager team, is below the workforce. And um, this is a particular subgroup of a, uh, of a health organization, and you can see where the top leader uh, position is, uh, pretty much up into a five, um, consistent on each of these areas, and, and quite a large perception gap between top leaders and the workforce, but even more of a gap between top leaders and the managers. So how would you interpret this? It's not the normal view. Again, normally you see the gap between workforce and top leaders, and the managers uh, are higher than the workforce, maybe not as high as the top leaders. But in this situation, in every case except the very bottom on shared leadership, um, the managers see it lower. In fact, they're into actually a level two organization, only shared leadership 
uh, goes up higher. So uh, I've been working with this organization for the past year. Um, the, the, the top leader was a single person, top leader, the director of this uh, particular center. And the managers, um, there were about eight of them, and they were part of the management team. The workers, there were about 30, 35 of them, and you can see their results firmly in the organizational three category. Well, it seemed evident to me that the, the biggest issue here in this particular organizational subgroup was uh, how the management uh, supervisors were experiencing the organization. And it appeared that the strongest issue uh, was between the managers and the top leader. And of course, that is uh, what the situation was. And in this particular situation, it required uh, the executive director of this organization to step in and uh, initiate a leadership change. And we've been working with uh, this management group uh, to begin to build their leadership skills and build their, their whole concept of uh, becoming leaders and servant leaders. And, and uh, we're hoping to see this, uh, this develop and grow. But I think this is a significant um, a non -com uh, uncommon view that points out some very important things that, uh, that you can look at with them. You can kind of, in looking at the OLA, uh, have a hypothesis. I think this could mean this, and then you have a conversation with them, and you explore to find out, is that the case? But we have found with management scores being lower that often the issue is between managers and top leaders, especially if the workforce is higher. It kind of indicates that the managers are or helping the workforce along, but the real issues are between the managers and the top leaders. So I hope that's helpful. There are a number of patterns that you'll see with the OLA, and again, every OLA report is different, but some of these patterns, once you've seen them uh, once or twice, allow you to uh, uh, be more effective at facilitating uh, discussion and facilitating improvement plans to help the organization uh, move to greater health.